Hey gang, Jack Lair here. Uh, just another Sunday morning coffee. Uh, playing some more World of Warcraft. Um, I resubscribed. I got some, put some add-ons, and just generally having some fun. I do need to go into the dungeon here, but I'm not going to do that uh, because I am very rusty at tanking. Turns out. Uh, we are, however, going to go and turn in something kind of cool. So for those who don't know, World of Warcraft is a really weird place. And let's see if we can get the the high level. So here's, there are three different places. There's, well, sort of. These are the same place, just different alternate timelines. Figure that out. But there's Azeroth. Which is the Eastern Kingdom's... Uh, Kalimdor, those were the f the first two. Those are the main continents that were there. Northrend got added in later. Uh, then Pandaria, then the Broken Islands, and then Kul Tiras and Zandalar. And we're in Kul Tiras because I'm on the Alliance side. There's Alliance and Horde. They're constantly at war, hence the Warcraft. Um, and... So basically what's been happening here is that we're we're they're slowly wrapping up a lot of plot lines that they started in Warcraft 3. And Warcraft 3 was a phenomenal game and they're actually remastering it which I look forward to seeing. But in this version there are uh, we are on islands and there are tortoises or what are they? Tortolo? Tortolan. Tortolan Seekers. And they're these guys. If you can see there. So they're basically, and the idea is that they are very ancient. So a lot of them, one of the things they always say, and let's see if I can get him to say it. Yeah, so we're children to these guys, even though the fact that I'm pretty sure at least two of the races live forever. But I found a medallion and it said to take it to Collector Kojo. So, medallion you say? Well, let's have a look at it. I don't have all day, you know. And he's going to give me some Azrite. Oh, he's actually going to tell me. Orders from Majara. Studies the medallion and grimaces. Ugh, Naga. This medallion is inscribed with orders. Looks like Naga have been commanded to invade our shores and seize artifacts of great power. You know, I recently came upon one such object. See that dagger over there? Nasty thing. Gives me the willies. I swear I hear it whispering to me. So I'm pretty sure that is the... Wait, what? There was a dagger in the previous expansion that actually did whisper to you. So. If you find powerful artifacts, yep. bring them to me. And don't go trying to use them yourself. So. Yeah. Blade of the Black Empire. There you go. So this is probably a terrible plan, much like me when I was feeding the plant. So we're just going to hop on over here. What is the wagon wheel? Huh. There are a lot of things I still don't know. Why do I have the water textures turned down? Hmm. Whatever. Oh. Oh, oh. oh no. That was a terrible plan. 
Okay. Nagas. Bad. As you place the dagger upon the altar, it seems to shudder and blink at you. Yeah. You are filled with a sense of dread and foreboding. This is probably a very bad idea. Yeah. The whispers are faint, but grow louder as you hold the blade in your hand. So weak. Need. Blood. Souls. The voice trails off, but you can sense the dagger urging you on. Um, well, I mean, I guess if it's hungry, oh, and if occasionally you hear the sound cut out, it's because of the way that I have this set up. One of my controls is the control key, and then control, control S turns the sound effects off. Which is super weird, but every once in a while when I back up, it does that. See like that. That's nope. Guess I gotta go around this way. Fed it. Do 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 do. See what it has to say. Ah, much better. How cruel of that priest to leave me in such a state. But enough now. No doubt you have many questions. I can offer countless answers. Zalatath speaks once more. The servant of Nizoth prepare for their master's return. They intend to conjure a scouring storm to wash away all unbelievers. The particular ritual they will invoke requires three ancient artifacts, one of void, one of storm, and one of ocean. Even now I hear the void relic calling to me. It is being empowered or corrupted, I am not sure which. I see it upon a cliff overlooking a vast sea. Come, Paladin. We can find a much better use for such a prize. I don't... The Nagas seek relics of power to fuel the ritual. They intend to summon a scouring storm that will wipe this world clean of unbelievers. Fanatics. I realize it may be disconcerting converse with the weapon. Be at ease. I merely wish to see you reach your full potential. Why, just recently I helped another mortal hero defeat the Burning Legion. True. My selfless sacrifice left me weakened. Sadly, that priest proved short-sighted. You I sense you are truly destined for greatness. 
they will accomplish remarkable things together, you and I. Magnificent things. Any point dress for Okay, so what I was just doing is I was looking at the map to see where I could go and how I could get there. Um, I have we have this, which is the Flight Master's whistle. Now this is kind of cool in that n n people can fly now. I can't because I took a break from the game, and I'm still working on it. But what you can do is you can the, with the Flight Master whistle. Once you complete whatever task you're doing, you can just push it, and then what this will do is this will take me back to the nearest flight point, which then I can use that to go anywhere I need to for the quests. <coughs> Excuse me. So here we, it brought me all the way back. If you'll remember, there's... There's... Over there. So here we'll go... Boop. And we're going all the way over here. And we're going to get a nice, fun little fly over here. Now, you may be wondering about the graphs up above. So, I've been noticing that the game does weird things at different times. And you'll notice that I'm using an NVIDI NVIDIA GeForce GT 1030. Uh, that's because it fits in the case that I have. The case that I have is a slimline case. Uh, uh, weirdness. But, um... I've been watching the memory, and the memory doesn't move. It doesn't move at all. So I don't really think that that's much of a problem for what I'm doing. The disk drive, though, seems to be my bottleneck. And I'm not sure if getting a new one would be how much of an improvement it would be. Now, I put a solid-state drive in my laptop, and it made that go from an abysmally slow laptop to a functional laptop again. So if anybody, if any of you are out there with a uh, slowly dying laptop, that's weird. Then what you might want to do is uh, get a not a big solid state drive, but just a a decent one and throw it in there and see if it makes a difference because it did a lot for me. But we're kind of cruising over. These are nodes. Those are treasure chests. And this is my quest, which is taking us that way. And I'm I'm kind of a pack rat for everything. So here's my inventory, which has all kinds of nonsense in it. So, you know, we're now in Guild Tabard. I'm one point away from... Can I make the... Nope. Ah. I've still got this, which I'm... I need to find out if that's a one-time use thing, because I don't want to use it. Then again, I should use it, because I have it, and it's really annoying having... All those things. Uh, these are pets that I can st that I still need to collect. See, I have a, I have a pet tracker on here. I love my pets. This is why over here we go to the pet journal and I have 595 of them, and they're all kinds of nonsense. Tiny apparition. I should work on some more of those, but oh, why am I way up here? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I don't care. Mm, we'll go this way. Yeah, there's a trick in this game to kn knowing when to fight and knowing when to just go. Because sometimes it will be worth it to stick around. Like, I know that those quests are going to have me go in there. Mm. 
Oh, you want me to go way down there? Uh, maybe we'll get there later. Monolite, yay! How much did I get? Six? Is that enough? It is. So that makes 50. Which means I can now learn makeshift azurite detector. Boom. Oof. Oh, that's a lot. Okay, we'll leave that alone for now. And I do have uh, a bunch of different mods installed, just uh, because I... The normal UI is fine. Have the ritual. Got it. Um, I, I have a... I'm getting hit on by a dagger. That's a little weird. Freehold, really? What delicious irony that a pirate keeps such a coveted prize as a trophy. Okay, mm. so we're going to use our whistle again. The great thing is, is that uh, the whistle has a five-minute cooldown. So normally, that's just enough time for you to be like, "Oh, I need to go here. I need to go there," and actually get to where you're going. I know the pirate den. I've been there a handful of times. Oof. But yeah. So pets, mounts. I have 279 of these stupid things. Ashes of Alar. Some of my favorites. Am I filtered just my favorites? Nope. I 
think that guy. The bronze drake. The bronze drake is still probably my favorite dragon. It just is. Have my chopper. Booga, booga, booga. So the the paladin mounts. So in this game, there are two classes that get well. Originally, they got specialty mounts. There are it's the warlock and the paladin. And with the release of Classic coming up soon, I do kind of look forward to, if I roll a Paladin, doing the the Paladin quest. Because it, it made the mount worth so much more. In that you weren't, it wasn't just, hey, let's go, let's go buy a mount, buy a horse at the, the horse trainer's. Like you actually went through and had to get the, you had to get the bridle and you had to have the bridle made of a special leather and you had to have things made of special metals and then you had to have it forge it and then you imbue the, the spirit of a, of a horse long gone and then it all formed together into into your mount, which was kind of awesome. The only downside is is that the in 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 all of this does not exist. The collection tab, and I think that's going to be kind of a, a a rude awakening for some people. Is just that if you are if you are thinking you're going to be like it was, or you're going to you're going to have a bajillion mounts. You're not going to. Because you won't have the inventory space for them. Okay. I've been over here stealing a bunch of stuff from these people. So they probably really don't like me. Now, I am a, a paladin, so I'm a holy warrior, which is weird that I'm taking orders from kind of a notoriously evil, notoriously evil dagger. I am what's called a, a prot paladin or a protection, which means I'm a tank. Tell me what you want. Yikes. No. Yes. The trident is in my possession. Take the to the Okay. Yep, nope, nope, nope. Make your way to the shores of That is where the third prize awaits. Fuldoon. Ugh. So Valdun is the mm, PvP islands, for lack of a better term. But we gotta get all the way back here first. Treasure chest, treasure chest. I kind of don't care about those right now. Boop boop boo, boop boop boo. Boop. 
this is this is where World of Warcraft clicks for me, which is the the oh we we need we need to go here, we need to go there, we need to do this. What I don't like are the the quest that I was doing yesterday, I think, which is the oh we're we're here at the village. Hey, this dude wants you to kill the witches there, and this person wants you to destroy the witch's charms and this person wants you to free the villagers so i've got three quests that are basically go into the town kill the witches free the villagers destroy their charms and i'm like okay i mean it didn't this really didn't need to be three different quests but it seems like i didn't the and that's the leveling process which is a little different Ooh, fun popping. Oh, this is always fun when this happens. So basically what it is is that the the game did not load me. So if you look up here, I'm moving around. And this is, yep, there we go. That's because of, if you watch, look at the graph up there, my, my hard drive pegged out. So I'm pretty sure that's what causes that problem. Oh, and I missed the jump. I love that mount, but it is so hard to judge where I am. So we're gonna go over here, first of all, boom. Get my dudes, see if there are any new missions. Ugh, nothing I wanna do. So we're gonna come up here. And these are different islands? So now we're gonna go to Voldoon. And so basically, you come over here and kind of attack the horde, and the horde come over here. At least I think that's how it works. Excuse me. But it's still really weird to see. Which one is this? <coughs> And as you can see, I have not explored a lot of this. We're going to fix that today, I guess. Let's get on the road. Because I don't know what's up there. I do like the fact that in order to be able to... In order to be able to fly here... Mm, not worth it. I say that, and I'm going to need boatloads of that later on. But in order to be able to fly here, you have to have been everywhere, which is kind of nice. So at least they're not like, hey. Hmm. That looks like a horde camp. What? Seriously? The <clears throat> I think the 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 leashes have gotten way longer on some of the things. 
Because they seem to be chasing me down a lot lately. Like, a lot, a lot. I had one that did not give up until I ran a good long ways away. Granted, it was probably because he was killing me. It's pretty. I'm in the Lion King. It's the hyena land. <coughs> I know that your powers of retention are as thick as a warthog's backside. But thick as you are, pay attention. My words are a matter of pro Sorry. So these are rares, and they show up on your map once. They're kind of to help you along the way, and... <coughs> no, don't call the pack. That would be bad for me. But, uh... So normally these guys will have just Yeah, they just have some Ezra fragments. The the coolest ones were in um Legion is it up on the up if it's down I'm guessing down well cuz I'm pretty sure that's a cave oh, we'll do it this way no cave that is a cave okay That is the the paladin's infinite bubble, which is divine shield. You never know. Maybe Toatanas are really understanding. Never mind. I guess it's my turn. I wish at some point there was a... Okay, go kill it now. Oh, 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 okay. I was in a dungeon last night and I had never been there before. So it was it was very much a, like, okay, what do, what, do, what are we doing? And they were finally like, you can kill stuff now. I'm like, oh, great, okay. So then I went ham. Wow. 
Why did I? This is this is a bad plan. So many possibilities. Precipice of Oblivion. I've been there. Such magnificence awaits us. Ooh. Can I use that in this area? So I'll just do this. So I'm using my Hearthstone, which is the innkeeper's daughter, which is a toy that thinks it's a Hearthstone. Super weird. Um, <coughs> but yeah, rather than use the flight whistle to get back to the flight point, to get back to the boat, to get back to Borealis, to then fly somewhere, this this one's easier. Just push a button. And my mission came back. So if I need to, I can stop by here, there. Oof. Oof. Man, I don't want to go to either of those places. This place is just covered in Naga. Oh, I mentioned toys, so I should probably... So in the collections, there are mounts and pets. And those were basically uh, it. And then the toy box got added. Or maybe the toy box was already there. But these are things that, like, I have ones marked that I use a lot. Like, this is Molly. It makes a, makes a mailbox. This one turns me into a vulvar. This one just allows you to shoot a giant red ball. This, uh, in Warlords of Draenor, you could have a, a guy running around with you as a bodyguard. And this would make him small. Because I had a giant ogre running around with me, and I couldn't click on anything because he was always in the way. But there's, uh, all kinds of, all kinds of stuff. From events from Day of the Dead... Don't know. But yeah, like I have not gotten that. But there are all kinds of fun stuff. And there are just page after page after page. And I'm way behind on collecting them. Just because some of them are, you know, rare for dinner. It's it's somewhere in Nazjatar. Thank you, thank you for that. Moonflade. Oh, there's the oh. So the lunar festival are now toys. No, that one comes from the Dark Moon Fair Rocketeer Gold, which I don't think I can do. Oh, that's the banner. Yeah, so some of these shoot... Uh, some of them do random thing, or some of them do absolutely random things. I think I have one that's a, a teleporter. Just teleports me to a random location. And it gets the location right every time. Well, it transport transports you exactly where you need to go as long as you're not too picky, I think is how it's phrased. So we're going to have to go
think we're going to have to go all the way around. Oh, here's another one of these. Whoop, 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 whoop. Crap. Double crap. Triple crap. I fall off a lot of things, in case you have not noticed. But see, I don't care about any of these thing bats. Blah 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 blah. Boop, boop, boop. Dude, give up already. Ugh. Here we go. I have a special thing that lets me run on water. As long as I'm not being attacked. Is it in here? Nope, not in there. This is the problem with having been everywhere, is that it's like, oh, we need to go to the place. Like, I kind of know where that is. We're here now, I think. I don't know if, I mean, I guess I can go in and if nothing else, I can just run out. But this is a dungeon. This is meant for multiple people, not just, you know, me. <clears throat> a stone to call forth the darkness. This is going to go bad. So this is the last of the old gods. Think Cthulhu and whatnot.
Yeah, not good. What? Interesting. Well, that's uh, what you can look forward to if you decide to try and play World of Warcraft. And all of the nonsense that's over here, th that's not there when you start the game. I, I, This is me customizing it after many years of playing. But uh, I guess that'll do it for now. Oh. That can't be good. But thank you very much for watching and as always. Lay on.